An email that was sent out to Cabrini students October 4th at 7.17 p.m., the day before the threat was set to happen, stated, Dear community members, as some of you may have seen in the news, the FBI and the ATF issued an alert to all Philadelphia area colleges and universities because of a potential threat to an unspecified university near Philadelphia. The potential threat indicates that if anything were to happen, it would take place on tomorrow. As a precaution, we have contacted the Radnor Police Department and in increasing our patrols on campus. We encourage you to stay aware of your surroundings and report anything suspicious to public safety. I was sitting in my suite just playing some Xbox and I'm in a group chat with some friends and that's how I was really notified. And I was sent a link of the actual what the person who made the threat said and it just confirmed my beliefs that people in this world are crazy. And it really doesn't make sense why we have to be so violent to get your point across. I wasn't too sure. I mean like, I'm not gonna brush it off as a joke. But at the same time, I can't like let it stop me from going to class. You know, like you can't. I feel like so many students just use it for like a way to get out of class. Um, honestly, I didn't hear about the threat until like the night before. I had no idea that this came out. Um, I didn't really think it was that credible because it was on a 4chan site, which is not known to be very um, credible in general. So I didn't really think much of it. I wasn't really nervous because I didn't really know that much information about it. Um, a lot of my friends were talking about it though and they were kind of nervous. I called in all the extra public safety officers. There were um, many police officers driving on campus. Um, I talked to one of the public safety officers. They said they brought the third shift in early or the second shift in early. Um, so yeah, they did a really good job. I felt that kids felt safe. Um, but there was definitely like some tension in the air. You could definitely feel it. I feel they did a stellar job. I felt extremely safe. The cops were around all day. And yeah, Cabrini is a very safe environment. Uh, there was one Twitter um, or tweet that came out that said that Cabrini and Eastern should look out just because, not because we're a small school. Um, but it didn't really scare me. I didn't really think anything would happen here or in this area. There's 170 schools that were possible targets.